Dr. Dennis Federman is currently with us. I am doing another vehicle video. Yes, I am waiting again in the vehicle while my family member is in for an appointment. So, my focus time today will be about talking on struggle. And if you hear a few doors slam, people walk by, uh, vehicles behind me, again, it's because I am in a parking lot and this sitting in the vehicle. So might be a little distracting, but I will get my point across as clear as can be. Um, and it actually, what I'm talking about today is struggling. And then I have to say, it's been a bit of a struggle to do this so far because again, law of attraction will bring you the, what you're focused on and what your point of attraction is. So, um, this is my second or third time trying to do this vehicle video where someone hasn't like screech brakes or slammed the doors or come up to the vehicle or whatever. So let's just see how this one goes and we'll figure it out from there. So the word struggle, struggling. Now there is that that happens in everybody's life. There is some struggle or what we perceive or label as a struggle in your life. You might be struggling with an event. You might be struggling with uh, incident. Um, you might be struggling with something internally, something in the mind, something about what to do next, what's your purpose in life. Like there's a lot of things that people can use that word for struggle. Is it the right word? Hmm, maybe, but there is some connotation to the word struggle that has some negative feeling to it, like some not so good feeling to it because any kind of struggle, if you even think about like tug of war, it's a struggle from side to side and, and people are, you know, some are resisting, some are pulling, some are this and that, like there's that constant uh, struggle that you're having. So is there a better word for it? Maybe, well, maybe after this you'll use it. Maybe something like I need clarity on I am open to um, a better feeling than what I'm feeling right now that I'm going through. One of the things that I've heard, because again, it's been in my awareness and that's usually why I do the vehicle vehicle videos is is uh, because it's it's come up as people struggling. And in this, what I listened to video slash audio was, what is the opposite of that? So again, like we just touched on a bit, like, so instead of struggle, what word can you look up? Look up in the dictionary, what that might be. You know, what is the opposite of struggle? And then that's what you want to lean towards. So instead of struggle, you might want to use allow. Um, instead of struggle, you might want to use choose. Instead of struggle, you might want to use feel better about whatever it is that you're going through that allows the energy to shift. Then there is what I listened to going back to that, um, earlier, actually this morning again, and it was, I just give up and I give in and I let go. So some of those words can work as well. Now, say for instance, you're dealing with health. So I'm struggling with my health. Say that is your issue or your concern or your point of attraction right now. And if you say, well, I give in to wellness, I just, I let go of the struggle and I give in to well, my well being. I give in to allowing things to be good in my world. Like there's a, again, a lot of things that you can say and verbiage, but it, it takes focus and you just have to be willing to take the time to focus on it. I mean, I'm going through, I wouldn't say a struggle, but I'm getting very clear on something, um, in my own personal life right now. And I know it's easy that you can just, again, stay in the negativity of it or the problem of it or the concern of it or the struggle of it. But how does that serve? Because that energy, law of attraction, will just bring me more of that. That's not where I want to go. It's sort of like wanted and unwanted. So you have an unwanted whatever it is, 
and you want to get it to the wanted to what you want instead which is tell a new story use different words different mindset change perception do things to make you feel better like there's lots of ways to take to, to jump from one end of the stick to the other or jump from one side to the other or the wanted to the wanted so just a just something to think about that if you're whatever that is i'm struggling with my health Okay, well, I give in to the struggle and I allow health instead. I let go of the struggle and I just allow my well-being and the cells of my body to do what they need to do and everything will be well, all is well. Like whatever words feel the best for you. And that's the thing is that you need to have those feeling words for you because otherwise words are just words. But what feels better? What uplifts you? What words can you say to you that will actually take you out of sort of like the problem unwanted into more general feel good things? Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Because, um, again, we want to feel good as much as we can in this life. We know that things will come up here that we do need to address. That's why it's called life. That's why, you know, it's part of the journey of life. Um, but if you don't know what doesn't feel good, then you don't know what feels good, too. So sometimes that, that contrast is good for you just to get very clear about what you want instead very good and I don't know about you but I feel way better feeling good than I do than feeling bad so so again whatever verbiage whatever words um, again look it up in the dictionary to see what the opposite of the word struggle is or or some stuff but again you can say the words like okay I give in and allow myself to feel better okay well you know what not going to do too much change it a little bit but what you want to focus more on is is like what words what verbiage what feeling feel about when you felt better again use an example of health feel when you felt better and 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 spend time in your mind when you felt better and how did that feel because again you want to focus your point of attraction law of attraction will bring you more of what you're thinking and being so you want to be more of that thinking and being part. Feeling good. So again, until next time, thanks for joining us and we will see you at our next vehicle video.